Welcome back everyone to another Grand Theft Auto 5 video and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to do the speed glitch on the new Vigero ZX which is the lookalike of the Chevrolet Camaro ZL1. So this one was a bit of a newer vehicle and it, honestly the speed glitch works for a lot of the older ones as well. So let's just go ahead and get right into it. The only requirement that you need is you actually need to go inside of Los Santos Customs and make sure that your tires are set to standard and not bulletproof. So once you enter Los Santos Customs, what you want to do is go over it to tires or I think it's wheels. There we go. And then go to tires, go over to tire enhancements and make sure it is set to standard because if it's bulletproof, this will not work. Once you're done, just go ahead, make sure everything's like maxed out. That way you get the most amount of speed as possible. And then go ahead and exit Los Santos Customs. Now to do this, we're actually going to go over to the Los Santos International Airport. Because if we use the other airport, it's not going to give us enough long runway. So we're going to try to go here. Now once you make it there, you want to go ahead, go to the end of the runway, pull out a gun, and you want to shoot the front two tires of this vehicle. Go ahead and do it now or just literally any vehicle that you can use for this and now we're going to drive until the wheels pop so now they just pop so we're going to go ahead and try to do it now all right we're going to go ahead hold down the gas pedal and the brake at the same time then we're going to go ahead go one two three and then we're just going to hold it and we're going to let the thing do its thing you see here we're getting a remarkable amount of speed just out of nowhere and if it works, it's going to show like smoke going all over the road. It's going to show your traction. And that's how you know it's going to work. So let's just go ahead and slow down now. You may notice that it kind of lost a little bit of speed halfway through the track. So we're going to try to do this again as best as we can. So go ahead, hold down the gas and the brake. One, two, three. And there we go. And make sure you don't turn the car because if you do it, that's probably is what causing it. Yeah, it looks like that's probably what is causing it is having to turn your car a little bit. Just make sure to go into a straight line as possible. Let's go ahead and do that one more time here. Let's go ahead and see how straight we can get this. There we go. One. One, two, three. There we go. So it took a little bit longer than usual. But this time we got our speed and now we are going remarkably fast. Look at that. And that is how you do the speed glitch. It works for any vehicle and even works for the newer one like this. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to leave a like and subscribe for more GTA 5 videos and content like this. With that being said, you guys have a great one. Stay safe out there and goodbye. Have you ever been broke in GTA and just wish you could go from this to that without spending a bunch of shark cards that go from a $99 just to a million? That could probably get you a couple cars, maybe some buildings and businesses, but nothing to what you need. Luckily, we have OP Mods. OP Mods is a GTA 5 money account and services website that's basically really trustworthy. Not only do they actually show their proof of work and have a five star rating of Trustpilot, but they're also a lot cheaper than the other GTA 5 competitors. And you can even use code discount legit for a 5% discount on all your purchases. Thank you and back to the video.